Excel allows you to hide a group of sheets fairly easily. So I can click on sheets here. I'm just going to hold my control key down and maybe select those um, separate sheets. Right click one of them and you can select hide and that will hide those entries. Now the problem is is that you can't unhide them in the same way so when I right click and go unhide I can only select these sheet names singly so I can't select a group of them so if I try and hold my control key down it's no different just clicking it so that's the problem so I can't unhide a group of them so I click OK that will unhide that one this macro here that runs off this button unhide all sheet will basically hide uh, sorry unhide every single sheet so if I click that that makes every single sheet in the workbook visible so it's an easy way to unhide the group now to make it a bit more flexible what I've done is I've added a, a range here that's in the orange and it's called sheets to hide so if I select that in the name box you can see sheets to hide so any sheet name listed in this range will be hidden by this other macro that runs off this other button so at the moment I want to hide data and workings uh, all of these sheets are just empty there's just the name it's just an example so if I click hide data and workings are now hidden and then if I want to see them all again I can click unhide and so it's very easy for me to add another sheet name to the list so here's report one so now when I run the macro report one should be hidden so if I click the button now that report one is hidden and again I can unhide it so it's very easy to interact with the macro just using that range just putting the sheet name in now the sheet name does need to be exactly the same so if there's a space on the end something like that then it will be different and and it will stop it working so you must have identical um, sheet names in there so if you change the sheet name on the sheet you need to change it in the list for this to work now to have a look at the macros uh, just right click on a sheet go view code the macros are in a uh, mod examples uh, in this one actually um, are in a mod examples module uh, these these are called modules so it's mod short for module examples and so there's the unhide all sheet so this unhides every single sheet and it just cycles through what's called a collection called the worksheets so for each WS in worksheet so every single worksheet um, WS visible equals Excel sheet visible so it just unhides every single one the next macro is a little bit more complicated because at first uh, make sure that you haven't uh, you're not going to try and unhide or hide sorry the uh, active sheet so it, if it if it's not equal to the active sheet name then it will um, go through to the next test which is doing a count if on that sheets to hide range so it looks in the sheets to hide if the name is there so this would be greater than zero then it makes it hidden otherwise it makes it it makes it visible so basically this macro won't allow you to hide the active sheet so you if you do want to hide the active sheet you must be in another sheet that uh, is not going to be hidden uh, that's the way it works to copy this to another file you can just right or sorry just click on the the module and drag it up to which I think I've already done here but if I drag it up again it'll put a copy in there and it just puts the one on the end so you can just drag it around to put it into into another um, another file and so then those macros are available in that file you can actually as well if you want to do it another way you can copy the macro itself just by selecting the macro right click copy and then take it and put it in another module and just right click paste or control V to paste it so it's quite easy to put the macros from this file which is attached to the blog to another um, sheet or file that you want to use it with okay I hope uh, you found this useful